Copper is a chemical element, and there are over a hundred elements occurring on the planet. These are substances that can't be chemically interconverted or broken down into simpler substances. They're the primary constitutes of matter. Each element is distinguished by an atomic number, and copper is number 29. Copper is a metal and it's used in so many things. It actually doesn't react with water, so it's used as water pipe, and it also conducts electricity, so it's used in electrical cables. This means you can find it all around as scraps. When copper is out in the air, it reacts with oxygen and becomes copper oxide, which is why it's dull or even tarnishes and goes green. Vinegar that you find at home and eat is acetic acid. And salt, like normal table salt that you find at home, is sodium chloride. If you mix the two together, they make a stronger acid, which is actually hydrochloric acid. This is a chemical reaction and will clean the copper oxide, so the non-shiny part of the copper, plus the hydrochloric acid, which is the vinegar and salt together, make copper chloride, which is essentially the blue-green ink that you make from this reaction and can use in art. When you put your copper into the vinegar and salt mix in a jar, put a lid on and put it in a safe place because this is a chemical reaction happening. Leave it for a few days or weeks and see the green colour appear that you can then strain and make into ink.